Hello, Michelle Copper here with the Inspired Voice Business Coaching in Vanport Square Studio. Welcome to day 13 of my 30 videos in 30 days challenge. I'm very excited today because my friend Simone is jumping in and going to record as many of her own videos in the next 30 days as she can. So woohoo! Nothing like that collaborative energy boost of having a friend jump into a challenge with you and rising those boats all together. So welcome, Simone. She's got a great question and a great point I think many of us can relate to is that kind of deer in the headlights moment where you think you know what you're going to say and talk about and all of a sudden your mind just goes blank when you walk out onto the stage or step up in front of the people to make a presentation or the networking group to reel off your elevator speech and we all have that to some degree and the more we put ourselves in that situation and do it the easier it becomes the more we get accustomed to it and eventually that moment of fleeting panic where everything falls out of our head does go away. So Simone's going to rock that out by doing her own videos this month. The other thing that I've been working with which is really helpful is simplifying and streamlining my ideas. So picking the topic, answering the question. For me, it's been about having a question come in so that I can then formulate an answer and have about three bullet points that speak to the tools that I can offer in that situation and then move on. So I have an introduction, hey this is my name and what I'm doing and then the three bullet points after the question and then thanks so much for being here and that formula is working and I'm getting better at it as I move through this challenge. So putting yourself out there again and again is a great way to get better at putting yourself out there and then organizing your thoughts, the tools that you're going to offer, the suggestions and the comments, whatever it is your content is going to be, into three simple words or bullet points that will trigger you to talk just a little bit about each one and then conclude has been the formula that I've been using and I think it's become effective and it's working for me. The other thing I would say lastly is this idea about I don't have to include every single great thing that I've ever thought of into every video. I don't have to say it in the perfect way. I don't have to try and get every cool little nuance of all the different cool things I could say into every video. And remembering that and rather than than getting held up about like trying to remember it all before I even start. Having those bullet points will hopefully trigger most of what I want to say and then moving through those bullet points allows me to say what I say in that moment and then maybe I'll do another take or maybe two more takes and see if I get that other cool thing that I wanted to do in there but I don't have to get it all in every time and then I'm going to go with the one that's the most effective and clean the take that is overall the best and let it be good enough and move on to the next day that's what I did today and every day so thank you Simone for jumping in with me I can't wait to watch your videos and all your adventures that you will have and thanks everyone else for playing with me. I would love to hear your thoughts, your comments, your questions, your challenges about putting your work out in the world in the biggest possible way. What's stopping you from being the amazing you you are and sharing it with the world in the biggest possible way? How are you speaking up? being heard and getting paid in your life and how could I support you. Thanks again. See you tomorrow.